Hello dear students, today we will solve some of the problems on quantum free electron theory of metals. And that first one is, the Fermi level in silver is 5.5 EV, find the velocity of conduction electrons in silver. So he has given the Fermi velocity and he has asked you to find out the velocity of conduction electrons that is Fermi velocity so here Fermi energy he has given EF is equals to 5.5 EV thus we need to convert in terms of joules right and we have the formula for VF is equals to root of 2 into EF divided by M right so here EF value he has given so that we need to substitute and m is the mass of an electron so a standard value that we need to substitute and when you simplify this entire term we will be getting it as 1.39 into 10 to the power of 6 meter per second this is the Fermi velocity or the velocity of the conduction electrons in silver so this is how we can uh, very easily calculate when we know the Fermi energy so the second problem calculate Fermi energy here he has asked Fermi velocity here he has asked you calculate the Fermi energy in terms of EV for a metal at 0 Kelvin given electron concentration N is equals to 5.863 into 10 to the power of 28 so he has given the electron concentration and he has asked you to calculate the Fermi energy so electron concentration N is 5.863 into 10 to the power of 28 we know the Fermi energy is given by EF is equals to h square divided by 8m 3 divided by pi raised to 2 by 3 n raised to 2 by 3 so EF is equals to h value you need to substitute 6.63 into 10 to the power of minus 32 raised to 2 8 into m value 9.11 into 10 to the power of minus 31 3 divided by pi raised to 2 by 3 n value has given so that you need to substitute here 5.863 into 10 to the power of 28 raised to 2 by 3 so when you simplify we will be getting it as 5.85 into 10 to the power of minus 38 into 1.5091 into 10 to the power of 19 and again when you simplify you will be getting it as this but this is in terms of joules this we should convert in terms of EV because he has asked in terms of EV right so when you convert it in terms of EV it will be getting it as 5.5 electron volt that is Fermi energy for a given metal is 5.5 EV so this is how we can find out the Fermi energy when the electron concentration is given so moving to next problem in the next problem Calculate the probability of an electron occupying an energy level 0.2 EV above the Fermi level at 200K and 400K in a material. So what he has given is he has asked you to find out the probability function that is f of E at 200K and at 400K and he has given the energy level above 0.02 EV Fermi level so here we can take E minus EF is equals to 0.2 EV that you should convert in terms of joules ok and he has asked you to calculate the F of E at he has asked you to calculate the F of E at 200k and F of E at 400k right so first condition f of e at uh, 200k we have f of e is equals to formula 1 divided by e raised to e minus ef divided by kt plus 1 so 1 divided by e raised to e minus ef value we have already taken it as this so this you need to substitute here divided by k is a constant value k value is written here 1.38 into 10 to the power of 23 and t is 200 because we are dealing with the case of 200 kelvin that you need to substitute here plus 1 so when you simplify this entire term 
we will be getting it as e raised to 1.1594 so when you simplify this whole term we will be getting it as 1 divided by 3.188 plus 1 or which is equals to 0 0.24 which means that f of e is 0 0.24 at 200 kelvin that is the first case then for the second case we have to take it for f of e at 400 kelvin so let us see f of e at 400 kelvin f of e is equals to 1 divided by e to the power of e minus cf divided by k into t t is 400 here because we are dealing with the second case plus 1 so when i simplify this whole term i'll be getting it as 1 divided by e raised to 0 0.5797 plus 1 or when i simplify this i will get it as 1 divided by 1.7855 plus 1 or after simplifying this we will be getting it as 0 0.36 so f of e at 400 kelvin is 0 0.36 so this is how we can very easily find out the probability function f of e at 200 kelvin and 400 kelvin okay so these are the some problems on quantum free electron theory okay thank you